Hello guys and welcome to today's video. Today we have a legendary product from a company called Basis. This is a WM02. So this is an updated version of WM01, the previous generation earbuds. And these guys currently sell on AliExpress for around about 20 to 25 US dollars, depending on when you're gonna buy them. Uh, New Year Eve sales are coming up soon. Um, so obviously you can buy them cheaper. Personally, I purchased them from official Basio store for around about 15 US dollars with coupons. So without further ado, let's unbox it and see what comes inside. Inside you'll find the earbuds themselves. We will talk about them just in a second. You have a charging cable, USB Type-C, a pack of interchangeable silicon ear tips. You've got medium size pre-installed on the earbuds and you've got small and large uh, earbuds in the bag just there. You have a welcome coupon, uh, which comes in Russian, English, Chinese and also a Spanish. You'll find a manual inside of the box. It's quite, use it's quite a useful manual. Actually, it tells you how to connect your earbuds to your phone and all the rest of it. Here are some languages uh, that are in this manual, amongst which you know, you'll probably find the most common languages across the world. You also have a warranty card just in case if anything goes wrong with your product, you can always fill that in and you can send your product back to the official seller. And obviously they'll action it from there. They'll either give you a full refund or they will replace a product or they will try to fix your product. So, you know, that actually exists. And finally, just to make your day, there are four little stickers from Basius. Right, so first thing first, let's throw a couple of figures about these particular earbuds. So first major improvement on the new generation is a Bluetooth module, which is now 5.3 instead of 5.0 from the previous model. Um, the distance that these earbuds will be comfortable to work with your phone, so to hold the actual like range, uh, will be 10 meters, but I can, I can assure you, you can go further away from your phone with these earbuds and you won't experience any dropouts, so they should be just fine. The playback time from a single charge is five hours, providing that you're going to be listening to these earbuds at around about 70% volume. Um, if you charge your case fully and your earbuds fully, you are guaranteed to have around about 25 hours of playback time. So therefore you can charge them once. And for a general user, you can probably never come back to charging them again for around about a week or so. The earbuds themselves, they have 40 milliamp battery inside of each earbud and the case has a 300 milliamp battery. You can fully charge that battery within an hour and a half. And then if you wanted to, if you're desperate for you know a quick charge, you can put them on charge and within 10 minutes you will be guaranteed a two hours of playback time of music so therefore you know you can be coming back home with zero percentage you can just whack them on for 10 minutes and you can walk away and you can be still listening to the music for further two hours so as i said you've got usb type c to charge your um, earbuds and it might not be a significant change but now the earbuds weigh three grams each um, compared to the previous model, which was four grams. So now let's talk about the visuals because I think this is the biggest upgrade from the previous version and I actually have a previous version there. Um, just to clarify, these since day one, when I purchased these, right, um, I have been using these extensively and it shows because there's a little chip down there, um, there are markings at the back and also the base of the earbuds, which, which is supposed to be white, is now all kind of pink because they are constantly in my backpack and I use them every single day. So the first thing you can see is is biggest change. Now you've got a see-through cutout, uh, which is like basically just like a bit of plastic over here. The reason for it is because the base, base use company actually listens to what their um, consumer has to say. And in the previous years, um, a lot of, I, I remember a lot of subscribers were saying, so once I put my earbuds away, how do I know that they charge? Well, now you do. And that's precisely what Basios has done. They've listened to all the complaints, they listened to all the feedback and everything else. So now every single time you put your earbuds back in, as soon as they start charging, you can actually see it through this um, plastic window. The second biggest change is that the case itself became a little smaller, thinner, it's not as tall and it's just more compact. Now, compared to the previous model, where as soon as you open up the lid, you can see it actually holds it, right? Um, I don't know if they've done it intentionally or not, but with the second generation, you don't get that. So as soon as you tilt it forward, the lid um, starts to close. It's not a big deal. It's not a, it's not a, like a deal breaker for me, but I'm just, I'm just, you know, I'm just spitting it out, out, out there because some people will be, um, will be looking for it. Now, if we take the left earbud out, um, once again, the biggest change is it's the 
the way they've um, they've done the LED lighting now. On the newer model, you've got that really fancy looking circle and I quite actually enjoy looking at that. Whereas with the previous model, you had your sensor touch panel and you had this tiny cutout for the LED to actually to see what was going on, right? The actual earbud itself, like I said, the previous model was four grams. Uh, this one is three grams, so it's smaller, it's, it weighs less, it's a lot more compact, it's slimmer, it's just, just in general, like I'll, I'll show you side by side. I think the second generation is by far less noticeable in your ear, especially if you pick up a right color. Now, just because I just said about the colors, there are actually four colors to pick from. You've got this sky blue, which I've ordered uh, initially, but you also get uh, colors like lavender, which is fantastic for ladies, and also black and white, which is more of a like conservative colors. And personally, because I like this so much, I'm gonna be ordering these in um, lavender and black as well, because I just wanna keep a couple of those because they're so inexpensive. What we'll do now is I'll demonstrate to you how the microphone sounds in these earbuds, because it's very important, because more and more people nowadays, they become uh, more dependent on their gadgets and a lot of people are sort of like you know their lifestyle has changed so you need a pair of reliable earbuds that you can actually use to have like a phone call conversation with people something you can put in your ears and you can be like um, you can have it pretty much in your ears all day long um, which in this case you can because it's comfortable enough to wear all day long you know you know you don't feel them uh, and they actually integrate into your ear really really well so I'll demonstrate how the microphone sounds. So this is a quick test of Basus WM02. This is a quiet environment. I'm speaking with my normal voice. And what I'll do now is I'll quickly just turn on the um, extractor hob and I'm gonna turn it onto the loudest, like the most powerful option. And that should give you an idea of how this EBUS will work in a loud environment. Uh, basically, um, how it's going to cut out the noises, how do your sound, like the voice going to sound and all those things. And hopefully it's all good. So now that you've heard how the microphone sounds, what I want to show you is what you can do with a base use app. Because believe it or not, the majority of base use products nowadays, they actually have a dedicated application um, on which you can download to your phone to take it a step further, all right? So we'll, we'll jump into that and I'll tell you about the positives and negatives of the app and what you can do within. And then we're gonna come back and we're gonna summarize today's video. Right, so it's only a quick one, guys. Let's jump into the Base Use app. Uh, within the app itself, you'll be able to connect loads of Base Use products. Um, the list is endless, uh, but obviously we wanna talk about our earbuds. So you connect those through the Base Use app uh, as you can see, currently they are switched off purely because if I was to turn them on, uh, the internal microphone of the earbuds would start recording. I don't need that. Um, so we can see the earbuds themselves. If you jump into gesture settings, you can uh, choose things like uh, what you want for double click to happen. So for instance, you don't have to have it to be like play or pause. You can change these um, commands. You can change it for like s uh, switching tracks or increasing decreasing volume whatever whatever is available in there you can switch it to that also you can choose what's going to happen if, uh, uh, when you're going to long press the sensors and also what's happening when you're going to uh, triple strike uh, the sensor on the earbuds as well so you can change that now you can't see it because obviously um, i've got my earbuds turned off at the minute but usually on these in this menu here in the settings you would have seen a a message saying that there's an update available and underneath the update it tells you what will be improved so one of the things would be the uh, sound latency will be decreased further uh, although it is only 60 milliseconds but obviously it will be decreased even further uh, and also in the update, it says that the equalizer will become available. So therefore you will be able to equalize the sound of the earbuds, which is, which sounds fantastic. I would love to try that, uh, try that option. However, whenever I'm trying to update my earbuds, it goes up to 50% and then it gets stuck. And it, it, no matter how long you leave it for, I've left it for hours and hours, it still doesn't go any further than 50%. And eventually you just have to cancel the update. Um, and it just just it just never worked for me. I have been in touch with the Basius head office and I'm still waiting for an answer. As soon as I get any information about how to solve this issue, um, I'll get back in touch. But for you, 
um, especially if you're using a different type of phone I'm using iPhone 13 you know maybe for you it's not gonna be an issue maybe you'll be able to update and you'll be just fine but for me currently um, I'm still stuck with uh, you know um, being unable to update and also just to um, just to mention as well um, if you've lost your earbuds you've got up to I think 35 hours or so um, a, your phone and this app will be able to track them down the last time that you had a connection with the earbuds even if they were disconnected but they were in your pocket or whatever so let's say you left them on the table you will be able to trace them down and actually find them so that's that's a cool feature as well and also if you've lost your earbuds somewhere near you so for instance at home there's an option where you can just press find the earbuds and your earbuds even though they're still in the case will start um, like emitting a really really loud noise and that should allow you to find them real quick as well right so now it's probably the most crucial point because I want to talk about the sound quality of these earbuds I thought that when this is gonna arrive, I'm just gonna probably say usual thing. I'm gonna say that the bass is fantastic, you know, meets a good highs or whatever. But in all fairness, when I've listened to these earbuds for the first time, all I remember is just a heaven smile on my face. And my wife was like, what's, what's, what's wrong? What's, what's the matter with you? And I said, you know what? It's, it's just, it's a mind blowing. I said, I've never ever experienced anything like this. For such a low budget earbuds, I said the sound is astonishing. It's just so perfect across absolutely every single frequency, like every single range, everything. And I've listened to every single genre, every single like musical style, and I can guarantee you that absolutely every single track, song sounded absolutely amazing. So things like rock, classical music, you're gonna be absolutely blown away with the sound quality. It sounds super crisp, it sounds super clean, it sounds super balanced as well, because when you need that kick, it's gonna be there. When you need that bass line, it's gonna be there. Right now, you can throw at me absolutely anything you've got in your arsenal. Like for instance, you can say this brand, this product, this whatever, whatever, these, you know, the, the, the e-bus that cost little or way too much, I can guarantee you that these little guys will absolutely destroy them. Because the sound quality on these is astonishing. The sound insulation is fantastic. It's got, it doesn't have like active noise cancellation or anything like that, but the passive noise cancellation is great. Sound is crisp, price is fantastic. And that's all basically I have to say about these earbuds. It's like, for me, that gets 10 out of 10, 100% guaranteeing, um, recommending, go out there, pick yourself one of those in color of your preference and you're gonna be absolutely blown away, happy for the rest of the, well, probably next generation, until the next generation comes out. Trust me, these will be your favorite pair of earbuds. Thank you very much for staying tuned. Thank you very much for subscribing and supporting this channel, guys. I hope this video has been helpful. If I have missed anything, don't hesitate. Comment down below and I'll do my best to answer your questions as soon as I possibly can. Thank you very much and I'll see you guys in the next video.